back to Imperion Galactic Survival, my Tempest Stark. Guys, today, Elyon Studios just released, released Alpha 10.5. So I need to know in the comments, guys. You guys want me to start over? Uh, and, uh, because supposedly there's, the Talon can now attack. At least that's what I read in the, uh, patch notes. That, and you can, uh, you can make Pentaxid now. If you you can make Pentaxid in the advanced constructor, you go under here. Right here it says Pentaxid raw material. It output count a hundred, but it costs you five Prometheum ore, uh, five Arrestrum, five Zocosium, five Sathium, and five crushed sand to make a hundred Pentaxid. I I don't know about that recipe, guys. Uh, we're gonna probably not make that because once you have an auto miner on a pentaxid, you don't really need need to one one auto miner should be good for you. But uh, <clears throat> today we're gonna I'm gonna finish taking out all the POIs on this planet. Unfortunately, I did an episode and they're black. It was just nothing but black screen on my recording software. So I had to scrap the video. It was basically I went over over here and I took out the mainframe and all the turrets, which kind of bummer that I didn't get to record it. But we got an armory, a shrine, our spaceport, and another spaceport to deal with today. So let's get over there and uh, let's turn on the lights. Max thrust, shield mode. So shields are on. RCS is on. Okay. So yeah, we're going to do a couple of POIs today. And then I just, I'll wait for you guys to comment. Oh, another thing is, uh, Anthony, I think his name is. Uh, he said to put the shield generator inside the the thing so I, I did I put the shield generator right here it doesn't look too bad the tank still fits in here and my little wood chipper sits in here so yeah it it's good uh, I'm out of power okay man this thing chucks through power I gotta find a better ship guys if you guys know a better ship that's got shields already enabled let me know guys Okay, I'm already heading the wrong way. Need to be heading... That way. So yeah, we're going to take out the remaining POIs for the Xerax. And supposedly you can have Talon attack your base, but I don't know what that it really entails. They weren't too clear on what the Talon would actually do. They're going to come in and turn off your power, and then you have to go fight them up. Um, I'm not getting that. Do they get a dropship too? Do I have to start over so that I can get the dropships to come? Or do I just have to kill a whole bunch of natives? See, those are questions that uh, I'm probably going to answer uh, whenever I uh, I go attack the Talon. I'm going to go attack them and see what happens. See if they do a base attack or do I have to start all over again. But let me know, guys. You guys want me to start all over again with Alpha Experimental 10.5? Or do you guys want me to wait wait until uh, it gets to the stable branch and then restart then? Did I take all the guns off this? Yeah, I did. Okay. Supposedly, they added a whole bunch of new POIs to the game. Or updated POIs where the POIs will use... A shield generator so it takes a few more rockets to take out the shields so basically what I'm thinking that they meant was that uh there's a drum just hiding in the trees okay but I don't know what they meant by the Talon being able to attack your base and 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 basically turn off the power uh, 
Oh yeah, I forgot this was Xerox territory. There is a spawner right there. Okay, so the turrets are taken out on that one. So let's just go take out the turrets on this one. But yeah, guys, let me know what you guys want me to do. Do you guys want me to want me to start over and play with Alpha 10.5 and make the Talon my enemies? Which I'm kind of I'm gonna I'm gonna wait and see if they give release. I must have already killed that spawn plate. I guess this is a good place to go in. Hello. Ah, oh, there's Zerak spawning up stop. No. I'm on the wrong gun anyways. Okay, if you take out that sensor, this guy won't pop out. If you look right here. Oh, it doesn't say that it, it's, uh, says it's hardened or hit points 40. Huh, interesting. Actually, let's go up this time. I do love this gun. But yeah, guys, let me know. Do you guys want me to start over? I can start over and... If I do start over, I'm going with the stipulation I'm not allowed to mine any ground ore out. Please wait while I loot the body of your friend. Guess that is this one done. As you can tell, I got some auto miners and a, I got a few more rounds. That is the cargo box. There's not very much room. Let's just put all this junk in the fridge. Okay. Is that drones coming in? They're just sitting there. Really? Okay, I was down here looting. I already looted that. I thought there was another container down here. Yeah, right there. Some silicon or drill. Mm. 
Okay, I think that is pretty much this spaceport. Done. I still hear Xerax. Yeah, they're probably just outside. So yeah, there's this spaceport done. We'll get this last loot container that I know is here. I can't carry it anymore. I know. I was preparing myself for the worst. I was gonna go in guns blazing. Okay. That spaceport is done. So yeah, where I'm gonna, this is gonna be my my temperate world is gonna be my uh, my world that I try I try and uh, make the tell on my enemies and see what they do to my base. I know you're there. I see your little red dot on the screen. What's up with the drones? Is it the new update doing this to the drones? Did it break my game? Hello? I'm right here. Ah, man, that would really be messed up if it broke my save game. I don't like them lingering, though. So I'm just going to take them out. Okay, back to the... I guess we could do the armory next. And then we'll hit the last... We're going to need to take out some of these guys. Not a good idea. He shot his friend right in the back. You see that? I saw that. He's like, you're in my way. And then he shot him right in the back. Oh, I still got some more ammo. Some stomach pills, just what I wanted. Okay. So that Xerox squad is down. Okay, I'm not gonna worry about picking up the loot off these guys. I got plenty of loot back at the thing. I wanna, I wanna get in here and get this POI done. I'm using the wrong gun again. That's okay. This is a pretty simple POI. Some more auto miner core. Another one. I ran out of materials, so I can't. I can't make any more auto miners.
got a T2 shotgun, a regular shotgun, T2 multi-tool, some fuel packs, some more hardened steel. We'll just take all that. And we want to keep those on us. What? Rifle upgrade kits. If we have time in the video, guys, I want to really go over and see the the trader. I want. I got some things that I want to trade him. Maybe get a couple more auto miner cores. Okay, this one with all the. Bo oh yeah, 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 guys. I'm not gonna subject you guys to going through all those boxes. I barely have enough room on this ship. To fit the items that I have in my inventory. Because I packed uh, the box full of ammo. Okay. So that is the armory. Now we have this last one over here. Let's just punch a hole through the door. Run in. Oh, they got one off. What? Hello, Mr. G Rex. I never really paid close attention to these guys. Look at those like wires sticking out of the back of his head. Hey, I'm busy. Quiet for a second. That is just weird how. He's got like wires sticking out of the back of his head. He's got like a jetpack on. You holding the shotgun, bro? Uh. That was a nice seat rack. See, let me take a picture of him. Okay. Downstairs and spawn pad. Oh look, same guy, same deal. He, he doesn't attack me. Okay, so you have to be looking straight at him, so you can go up, you can go up behind him all day long. Yep, the bug's still there. If you bum rush them, they can't shoot you. Hmm. You are that You killed. I killed you in this science. All in the name of science. Such friendly Xerox led me into their nice abode. Let me take their crap. Okay. I don't really need any of this stuff. I got plenty. I thought there was another container down here. 
If I need to, I'll come back and loot this, guys. I'm, I'm only going to do the loot containers. So that was... That should have been the all... Oh, yeah. Well... We can just eat the salami. Okay. That's this place loaded. Or actually, did I miss containers upstairs in the last one? No. Okay. Just making sure. Pistol upgrade kit, a shotgun, some fuel, some solar panels, some cobalt, and some magnesium powder. I always take a... Hello. Where'd you guys come from? Huh. They must have crawled up here somehow. Okay guys, that is, that is basically, let's go set some auto miners down real quick, because we still got time. And I want to know what's on that, that square block. Now that all the Xerax are gone from this area, or the planet, it's time, it's going to be time to move on. Okay, where did I put the auto miners? I would put them in here. That's one on copper. Let's get this one square that I didn't mark out out of the way. Okay, there's nothing hidden in that black square. So we're gonna we're gonna go pee off the talon, and then we're gonna sit around the base for a few minutes. But since I'm out and about, I might as well finish setting up these auto miners that I was going to do, because I want to have enough material to take with me just in case I need to build something. As you can see, I built this base right here, the Azura Alpha 10 base it's an unlock level 12 size class 3 and this is all the dimensions I don't know what kind of guns it has on it but I, I built it and uh, the next planet that we go to I'm gonna plop it down so for you guys uh, if you have any bases you want to see me bring into the world I think I have 10 planets in my solar system so that's 10 10 bases that I can spawn because I don't want to rebuild a base like every time I go to a new planet. That would just be weird, ridiculous. Actually, I really could use some eggs to make more meds, but that's fine. But yeah, if you guys got any base builds that you guys would like to see brought in and tried out against the, uh, the Xerax. And, uh... Yeah, we're going to go uh, test the Talon out here. Oh, there's a drone. I don't know if that's better. I was getting a lot of continue and quit errors before I updated the game. Like, it was giving me an error like every 10 minutes it would pop up an error. I couldn't figure out why it was giving me the error. Let's go see the Talon. Uh, really? This ship is an absolute hog on power. 
that or it just doesn't have enough fuel tanks in it. I don't think I'll play with this ship, and the next time I, uh, next time I do a playthrough, I'll I'll pick a different ship. I like picking a different ship every time I uh, I go through and play play through the uh, the game. But we're gonna go shoot up some Talon and see what they do about my base attack. We're probably gonna be friends with the Xerax by the time we're done. But if I'm right, they I bet you they won't even shoot at the ship. We'll see. Go shooting up some Talon. There's so many Triceratopses. If we're going to go shoot at the Talon, we might as well get their goodies out of their base. Whoops. Can I make a cargo container? CVBA. We need to go to the fridge. We need to empty one item out of the fridge. Let's just take uh, the antibiotics can go out of the fridge. We can eat one of the honeys. Okay. No, that's not what I want. Can you make me a cargo container? SBHB. Make me two of them. Oh, don't tell me I got stuck on the tree of death. No. I hate those trees. With a passion. Before we go wrecking face in the talon, let's go put the auto miners down in their territory. I really don't need any more resources, but just in case I lose everything, I want to be able to just say, okay, I just need to make it to my auto miners and I'll be good to go again. I wish they implemented something uh, along the lines of like, uh, I'm quite curious to see what's going to happen once I make the tell on my enemies and you don't need to be friendly with a uh, faction in order to place auto miners down you don't have to be honored or exalted or you can just be neutral and you can put auto miners down Oh, I'm at out of miners. I can remedy that. This is not all the auto miners I have, guys. I'll, I, if I, if I have time in the video, I'll show you where I've, I've been putting the other auto miners. Okay, so is that every deposit? Hey, it looks like it, boy. Waypoint all these auto miners real quick. Okay, let's go take out that outpost. Okay, where's the outpost at? Because when I saw an outpost. These look like all friendly POIs. Eh? Let's start shooting up the natives. I want to see what happens. Will they attack my ship? Really?
I'm in a ship and you're running at me with sticks. Here. Do they have good stuff on them th these days? They have sprouts on them. I think I cleared the majority of them out. Come on, I made spots for it. Where'd it go? Am I blind? Ammo box, okay. Where's the ammo box at? Okay, I think we're enemies with the Talon. Oh man. Hey. You guys just spawn way too quick. Look, I'm picking plants in your area. Come fight me. You wouldn't let me pick the corn, so now I'm picking the corn. Yeah. That's right. Picking all the corn. Loon your baskets too. Which is just junk in it anyways. All I wanted you guys to do is share your goodies. And you wouldn't share with me so I'm just going to take them now. Aww, I'm hostile with the zoo. Talon. Aww. How's my rep doing with the uh, Xerax still hostile? Man, I thought I'd get more points than that for killing the Talon. Well, now the only thing left to do is wait and see if they, uh, I guess I could go in there and murder some more, but I just want, there are enemies with me now, so we should be able to get a, a base attack, unless you got to start a new game, which I hope that's not true, I hope you don't have to start a new game, go probably set down some more auto miners, actually you know what, I haven't done this POI, how many minutes do we have left, no we're, we're at 35 minutes, so yeah, Hmm. I haven't done this POI in a while. It's not really one that I like doing, so I'm just going to bypass it for now. Uh, but yeah. Uh, now we're enemies with the Talon. Now I just need to make it back to base.
Now, Leon Studios didn't say you had to start a new game, so I'm hoping that I don't have to start a new game. Which wouldn't be all that bad. I know how to play the game. I have, I have like 5,429 hours in the game. Just a couple minutes. I could really use some ones on Prometheum. Because I'm getting low on Prometheum in my base. So we put We got some Prometheum coming up Radiated Fog Joy So yeah where do you guys want Where do you guys want me to set up base at Or my next base at We have all these planets Oh they look different now Whoa They look different now in the galactical map. I wonder if they're getting ready to release like a galaxy map where you can jump from galaxy to galaxy with a special warp drive for your CV. So instead of having just one galaxy in your system, having uh, two galaxies in your system or having more than one galaxy. Okay, there should be Xerac patrols around here. yourself down. I just want to put an auto miner down. I'm not worried about picking a blue. Yeah, you guys missed the mainframe. I got dropped off up, up top and I fell all the way down and I had to run back to my my hover vessel. Too bad I had to scrap the footage. It was some good stuff. Okay, so we have more Prometheum now. Is there a way to auto trigger a, a base attack? Does anybody know how to auto trigger a base attack? Is there a hints code or a, a code that you have to type in and be like, I want to drone a, or a base attack and and it just the drones uh drones are a little broke right now i'm at auto miners there he looks relatively safe We're going to have all the Prometheum. But yeah, do you guys want me to start over and start from the beginning? Because if I did, if I did, then that would end my uh, arid start and all that. I would only, I'd be down to just doing one, uh, one series instead of two series back to back, rotating them out when I feel like playing them. I did hear a rumor that Alpha 18 is around the corner for the uh, for seven days to die, and I, I really I want to get my hands on it. I really want to play it. I want to see what they've changed. I like when developers change the games and whatnot, and make it more interesting. 
As you can tell, I got a lot of auto miners out there. Hello, Mr. Pangolin. I'm just here to set down an auto miner. Don't mind me. Okay. So there's another Prometheum this way that I missed. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna set down this last auto miner, and then we're gonna go to the base for a little bit and see if it's uh, actually. Can we check? We can't check because we're not at the base. That's what I really need. I need a I need a cargo ship, guys. One to one to go get all the ore out of all these auto miners once I set them all down. Cause this ship has no carry capacity whatsoever, and I have a lot of auto miners down. Okay, there's another auto. There's another. It's this way. Yeah. I was up here at the Xeno mainframe and I dropped all the way down and I literally had to run all the way back over here to the radar station all the way across the I literally fought so many Xerax on the way back. I, my inventory was full by the time I got back to the uh, hover vessel. Okay, so that's the uh, last Prometheum on this planet, I think. Let's get this silicon. And we'll head back to base after this silicon. I have one more out of mine, yeah. Okay. We'll head back to base and see what the base reads out as far as the Talon. See if they're going to attack me. That would be so awesome if they attacked me. They didn't say anything about Polaris. I'm not. I'm not paying off the Polaris. I need the trader to be friend. I need them to be friends with me. Actually, am I making the Polaris mad? No, I'm still honored with them. Okay. It's gonna go out. killing Talon and made the Polaris mad. I'm... Okay, let's head back to base and see what the base says, and then we're gonna call the video. I got so many auto miners down now. I'm not running low on resources. I could set out a couple more water generators to compensate with how much uh, pre Prometheum I'm bringing in. This thing already needs fuel. Okay, we're almost back at base. So yeah, where do you guys want to see this series go? I want to go to another planet. I'll see for a second. Yeah. Other than the unknown artifact right there, all of this has already been done. I didn't decor all of it, but that's pretty much it for the Xerox on this planet guys so I'm gonna get back to base and uh, see what's gonna happen with the uh, Talon see if they're gonna attack me we'll do the 10 tricks so we pass time so so time passes to see if they'll trigger a base attack do they get a drop ship too sorry about that I wonder if they get a drop ship too you know, like the Xerox do. Or will they just come for your base out of the wilderness? They just spawn in and come attack your base. I'm just gonna go, there's something big by my base. It's my capital vessel. Yeah, 
As you can tell, I added more guns to it. And the polarized shirt, Anthony said to put inside, and I think it looks good there. I think it looks good. Okay, let's get down here and look at the statistics of the base now. Okay. F4? No, not F4. P. Statistics. Base attack timeline, right there. It says it right here. Overall probability 37.3%. Location 8.4%. Reputation. Reputation, 19.1%. So, okay. So, how do I get them mad at me even more? Base size, 8.7. Can I do the 10 trick? No, it's not nighttime yet. I thought I picked up some eggs or whatnot. Okay, guys. So there, it shows in the in the uh, thing that Talon do attack, but I don't know how. Uh, let me cut the video here. I'm gonna unload the ship, and then I'll bring you guys back if if I can get the uh, base attack to trigger. All right, be back. Okay, guys, welcome back. I did the ten trick over and over again. I can't uh, no base raid from the Talon. And I did it like 10, 10 or 15 times. I basically used the 10 trick to speed up time and no base attack. So I don't know what triggers a base attack for the Talon. Maybe if I build a base uh, in their territory, maybe then they will uh, get mad and be like, oh, we're going to kill you now. But yeah. This is going to be the end of the video, guys. If you liked, well, if you liked the video, like and subscribe and all that. And I will catch you guys next time. Bye.